Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Danielle, but you can call me Donny B. As you have seen down in the title, this is going to be another laundry day, a lit laundry day, that is. All right, so it is the weekend and I am so excited. I have everything else cleared off of my schedule so I can go ahead and tackle this laundry with no problems, no interruptions or anything. Um, and in between laundry loads, you know, I'm gonna be doing other stuff around the house, but it's nothing too strenuous that will get in the way and cause me any, you know, burnout or fatigue or anything like that when I get ready to do my laundry. So today I'm also going to be introducing a couple new products. Um, and I think that that is about it. Whoop, hold on baby. He down now. He wants to be seen too. <laughs> um, as you can see, I've already sorted out Baby, leave that alone. <laughs> As you can see, I've already sorted out all of my laundry over here. I have my baby's clothes, my towels, my whites, my blues and my grays, and my reds and my blacks over. Are you are you finished? No? You still got some more in you? Okay. All right, so over there, those clothes are already clean. I just need to fold those and put those up. And those are clothes that were washed throughout the week. Um, I'm trying to go. I'm trying to get all of these other clothes tackled in one day. But all those other clothes, every you know, we ran out of some clothes for the boys, and so we had to throw a load in the washing machine um, because they ran out of they ran out of jeans. Okay, you done? Okay. All right. So without further ado, let's get washing. All right guys, so like I told you before, I pre-sorted my laundry on the day before just so I am ready and prepared and ready to go today in order to wash my loads. Um, that really, really helped and it got me all psyched and pumped up and ready to go. Like I told you on last week, if you watched my um, laundry video last week, my sons were having problems as far as they were breaking out and I decided to change up their detergent, which is why I'm using this Tide Free and Gentle. I found that it really does work and I noticed a big difference as they did not have any bumps within this past year also if you didn't notice I didn't put anything else in the laundry I didn't put any fabric softener or any scent beads or anything like that because I didn't want that to have any effects on them So I purchased this downy fabric softener dispenser and I'm going to show you why in just a moment. I have always wanted one of these. I've seen other people use them and I'm like, oh, how neat. But I never got one because I have a uh, fabric softener dispenser that's already built into my washing machine. Alright, so on to the reason why I purchased the fabric softener dispenser ball. Now this Lysol, there are no directions, well there are no visible directions to the human eye uh, from the first sight as to how to use the this Lysol laundry disinfectant. And then one day I was looking and I'm like, wait a minute, there's something under this label. So I peeled it back and girl, there were the directions. And so in the directions it said to put the Lysol disinfectant into the uh, fabric softener dispenser and so I wanted to use fabric softener as well so I had to purchase the fabric softener dispenser ball. So while I'm folding, I say, hey, let me give me a little laundry motivation. So I'm pulling up my girl, Coley Cleans. If you have not checked her out, I'm gonna leave her information down below. I love her channel and I'm sure that you will too if you're loving my laundry videos. She does laundry and cleaning and all types of vlogs as well. So make sure you check down in the description box to go and check her out. Everything seems so good. 
And let me take this time out to introduce myself. My name is Donnie but you can call me Donnie B. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you have not been here before, and if you have been here before, you have not hit that subscribe button. What are you waiting on? Um, don't forget to, before you leave out of this video, hit that subscribe button. Also turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out when I post an upload. I am a wife to my awesome and supportive husband by the name of Freddie, and I am a work from home mom to two beautiful little boys of name Hunter and Carter. Here on my channel, you'll find loads and loads of laundry motivation. I also have lots of lifestyle videos that I post as well. If you have not done so already, don't forget to go and follow me on Instagram. There you will have find more behind the scenes um, content about me. I'm trying to be a little more active on there, so I'm trying to at least post every week please don't hold me to that i'm still new at this all right so without further ado let me stop talking your head off and let's continue to follow Now don't laugh at me when I tell you this, okay? But when I got this downy ball out of the dry, I'm like, man, there's still some fabric softer in there. But then I realized, babe, you had this in the washer. It went through the wash cycle, so therefore, this is just water. I had to laugh at myself. Now, this right here is my favorite scent, this Downy Infusion Calm. I love this scent. If you have not tried it, I suggest you give it a try. I love the um, fabric softener as well as the dry sheets. It just has my clothes smelling so good. Someone help me catch my breath again. How did you stop loving me? I don't know if you've noticed it, but Downey has this new commercial um, advertising their new Downey lights. This right here is Woodland Rain and it smells so good. I don't know how new I am to the party, but I just saw this Lysol laundry sanitizer and it's for gym clothes. My husband goes to the gym every day and I wanted to put this in there and try it on his clothes and y'all, when I say there was not a stench of odor, gym odor in those clothes, man, it was gone. So I will definitely be adding this to my arsenal. Tell me now if you Okay, so no lie, my son loves macaroni and cheese. He eats it every day for every meal except for breakfast. And all of his clothes or most of his clothes look exactly like that shirt. Now I had this OxyClean up in my cabinet. I used it once and it didn't work like I wanted to work. Y'all, reading is fundamental. I did not read the directions. I thought I knew what I was doing. I mean, you point, point spray and then you put it in the washing machine, right? No, but the directions here said to squirt it on the clothes, rub it in, give it a good rub, and let it sit for 10 minutes. So brave and so stupid, just like the movies. 
And here are the results of using that OxyClean. This is the shirt that I used the OxyClean on. Now, everything is not 100% gone, but for the most part, like right there, there's a little stain there, but for the most part, that macaroni and cheese is kind of gone. And this is a shirt that I did not put any OxyClean on. So you could see the difference between that shirt and the shirt that I actually put the OxyClean on. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Donnie B TV. On your way out, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, enjoy your day.